<laughs> All right, welcome back to SOS. I'm Stats NBA. All right, today, sorry you guys, I'm boxing up. I've got a lot of stuff to do and very little time, but I wanted to share this cool little project with you guys. Yes, T-Rex is back. All right, he's back in the house with us. So, now I got to messing around with some Olight boxes, okay? And you know how it's got this these nice little magnetic surfaces right like this and they snap okay see that all right a lot of boxes and stuff will come with those things so i get boxes like that all the time and i started salvaging them right and this is just what they look like after you rip them out and this is ah, wow. all right that's the metal side okay that's the metal side of it and then let's see Here's the magnetic side of that. They look like this once you rip them out of the box, okay? They're magnetic. Let's see. Like that. See? <laughs> anyway. <laughs> you get the point. Okay, so they're little magnets. Let's set this to the side. I'll put that back in the bag in a minute. And I got to tinkering with this. I'm always building kits. And I just finished this for uh I did a little video about this on Patreon. I because I'm always tinkering and I'm always finding useful things, little little doodads and stuff. You know, you can make things with, and especially when you start packing up your your belongings and you start to discover all your left sided socks. Because you find all the left socks, you find the Tupperware with the missing lids <laughs> and all the other stuff. All right, so I built this kit a while back. And this, you know, this stuff kind of started a, <laughs> that's really cool, kiddo. <laughs> she's got to show me stuff. All right. She's making her own little stuff. She's building a princess castle. All right. So someone had sent me this and, and I uh, thought, you know, how cool that was, that this was this neat little kit. Comes with a detailed list of everything that's packed inside of it. Okay. So that's how this all started. I was like, well, dude, I could do that. Let me see what else I could come up with. So. Uh, it started with that thing. I was like, man, I said, why don't I build more kits? Cause I'm always building kits. So I whipped that thing together and that's got everything imaginable. I mean, anything from fire starting, uh, to you've even got Teflon cordage. So I mean like, uh, the, as you were Kevlar cordage, so you can do, uh, a bow drill fires and all kinds of stuff, stuff for signaling nine volt battery mixed with a little bit of uh, steel wool and some, uh yeah you've got stuff for fire starting of all all types candles water purification there's even uh there's even a glove in here for starting if you, need, if you want to use because you need a glove like a industrial rubber glove to work with your water purification tablets and stuff everything for making water filters it's even a coffee filter in here just so you could so you could use that for for that as well and uh some wet fire and all right, just so much stuff in here. A little razor, whistle, and um, the list goes on. You got a survival saw. I mean, I could go on and on about all the craziness that's inside this little kit. And I'm going to build a few of these where it's like we start from scratch, completely nothing, and we'll just build a kit. Uh, I'll do that with you guys. I'll do a quick little video of something like that. There's even some hand sanitizer that's used for fire starting as well. Uh, the big lighter, of course, with the rubber band to protect it from getting the button pressed. And uh, a larger compass, an extra ferro rod, a ferrocinium rod. And um, let's see, that's a pencil sharpener. So you can you can work on your uh, fat wood shavings. And uh, guitar picks are very flammable. So <laughs> ridiculously flammable. And <laughs> I, I like lighting them on fire. But... <laughs> You just, I mean, you don't even really have to shave off a lot and it'll just, it, it goes up like a freaking bomb is crazy. Like, anyway, I did a little video about it, but anyways, it's in the archive somewhere. Mm, well, that covers that sort of, I mean, there's, I mean, everything imaginable. So I said, can I go smaller? So I went from this to, to this and I came up with this. All right. So. Uh, this is just, I'm going to open up this one real quick because I, I don't want to go through every single one of these over and over and over again, but this is like the micro fire kit and it's, uh, uh, inside here. I mean, you got everything from the magnesium capsules from, 
uh, from uh, Stanford Outdoor Survival. I don't know if you're familiar with those guys. They make the bug out supplement gear, which is, they're super awesome people. Uh, they, um, their, their magnesium capsules are the bomb diggity and they burn holes through boards and stuff. But I made sure I got some of those in there. I got some fire cord in there. I've got some, uh, some quick starters and there's uh waterproof matches. There's also a, uh, you know, the little miniature folding pocket knife, little Swiss army looking thing that you can put on your keychains. It There's one in there and <laughs> I'm not trying to unpack all these things, but uh, I'll do a, I'll probably do a little, um, a big, big reveal later on of all this stuff because I'm, I'm going to offer them to folks that want them and I'm going to put the kits together and I'll, I'll go in full detail, laid out everything that's inside of them. And, uh, and I'll put like an SOS logo or something on it for you guys, for anyone who's interested in one. I don't know what, I don't know. This isn't a sales pitch. Okay. So <laughs> cause I don't even know how far this is going to go. I might just give them as gifts. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> who knows? Christmas is coming. All right. So uh, on the back side of here, I did my magnets and I just did three. I want it to be nice and stable. You can do two. You don't have to do three. I just want it to be a little bit more stable. And I did it so that you could, you could stick them any way you want. And the cool thing is you can take this out and just see, just pop this one out here. I'm, you know, someone said I should get more into this stuff because I really do put together a lot of weird stuff. And, and someone was, uh, was telling me, man, you know, you do this crazy stuff all the time. Why don't you do more stuff like that? And cause anyways, but it's just a regular Altoids tan. It fits in, uh, this is the non-label, uh, Altoids tan fits in the other one just fine with the, with the label on it. So if you want to use an actual Altoids tan, uh, these are just your, uh, pocket stuff for your mints and stuff. These usually you can buy them over the counter anywhere, different labels on them and stuff. And the what this one's even the water kit, uh, for water purification. Then you get, you got to have compass cordage, things like that. I was going to put a shelter logo on there, but you're not going to really fit, you know, large items for shelters and stuff. But when it comes to like fire kits and stuff like that, you will be able to Put together a pretty decent little fire kit and something for lights and you can come up with spare these are just icon logos like for a, a smartphone uh, i found these little logos online there's different ones so if you're looking for the logos that's really all you gotta do if you've got a printer and you can find some icon logos for like a, a smartphone then it, you just print that the icon logos out that's all these are and then boom you can all just snazzy them together, boom. And then first aid kit, nothing crazy. The I'll be doing a micro tourniquet. It's uh, uh, in in the emergency kits. There's uh, there's one you use. It's, it's called it's like a disposable tourniquet, and it's uh, it's it's a fat rubber band. It's literally just a fat rubber band, and uh, it's about uh, one and a half inch in diameter, and it works good for that. And you, you, uh, you do it in a flip where you don't have to cut it off. And it's in the event that if someone's got a lot of, if it embeds in the skin, uh, you can't reach under it and, and get it off. You do this little flip technique and I'll have to show all that stuff as well when I'm putting this little kit together, but just like that, they all go together and you just flip it closed, just like produce rubber band. And you just take this guy. Just slap it on there like that. Done. Anyway. <laughs> and you can stuff something like that in your car or whatever. And it's not, it's not meant to, you know what I mean? It's, um, uh, it's just something to, uh, to, to put together, you know, people get bored. <laughs> you ever get bored and you just want to like put something weird together? That's kind of what I do. <laughs> anyway. So. And this is my fault. I mean, this is totally my fault. And I apologize because this is what happens when I start cleaning out some of my drawers around here. I start finding the darndest things and slapping them together. You know, I, I have to organize them. I thought about like a pill kit, right? You know, you see those all the time. Like, it's not like this. 
but it's like got these little tabs one two three four five six seven eight nine ten whatever over the counter stuff and you just fill those up with whatever and then put the label on and a whole bunch of them just down the row and you could do that with so many other things like just build a total medical kit and man then you get into freaking oils and all this stuff you know what i mean Ugh. but it gets crazier as it goes but I, I want to do a full pack of, I just want to show you this cool little idea, kind of like just, you know what I mean? And uh, since since I just kind of whipped that together, I figured I'd, I'd show you guys and see what you think. And what do you think? Is that kind of cool or what? That's kind of neat. But I still have to put more stuff together, so just bear with me. And we'll build some tiny little, little micro kits, like this little micro survival thing. It glows in the dark, you know that? Anyway. <laughs> All right. All right. God bless you guys. Take care. Hey, 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 you get down the fiddle and you get down the bow. Kick off your shoes and you throw them on the floor. Dance in the kitchen to the morning line. Louisiana Saturday night.